Hey guys, welcome back to Chaos Core Tech. My name is Garrett and today is day 24 of 3D Printmas. That's right, Christmas Eve. So today I figured I would add to the 3D block zoo. And now I'll put a link to the playlist over here. You can see what other creations I've done and kind of a backstory on what the 3D block zoo is if you don't know. And this is my final contribution, at least for Primus. I might do more of these in the future. But for this one, I made a peacock. And I think this one was my favorite out of the three. I like the crab a lot. But uh, this one was just a little more interesting, I think. So I went with a block for the body, a block for the head, um, pretty much a block for the neck. I angled it a little bit on the side. Um, and then I sketched on the details for like the eyes and the feet down here. And then for the tail, I actually sketched one of these feathers out um, and then just patterned it all the way across um, in, sort of in an arc so you got this effect right here but once i did that it looked very flat and plain and i didn't really like it very much like each feather didn't have detail um, but if you could look on the back you'll see what i did for the technique i just went every other feather and pushed it back one millimeter so now they're offset a little bit and each feather has a clear outline and i really think it looks pretty cool by doing that and then of course just like the other ones i painted this myself um, my wife just sprayed it with this blue color on here, so I didn't do that, but she sprayed the whole thing with that, but everything else I painted. I just used um, a normal acrylic paint with paint brushes of, of various sizes. I used a pretty big paint brush for the uh, green along the tail feathers there. Then I used an orange color for the feet and the beak, white for the eyes, black for the pupils, and yellow for the dots on the feathers. And I think I actually did an okay job. Um, you know, it's not great. Um, certainly doesn't live up to my wife's standards. Make sure you don't look too close at these dots because there's a couple of them that are pretty gnarly. But for the most part, I'm pretty happy with how um, this came out. And um, I'm basing that mostly on my previous uh, 3D Printmas models. Compared to them, this is leaps and bounds forward. So um, that's all I ask of myself when learning a new skill is that I'm making improvements. And this is definitely an improvement, so I'm not going to give myself too hard of a time. All right, guys, well, that's it for day 24 of 3D Printmas. Uh, tomorrow's Christmas, and um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure you head over to Twitter and search the hashtag uh, 3DBlockZoo. There's still uh, tons, of, tons of great ones out there, and I think even today I saw one that was a, a wolf, and it was pretty cute, so make sure you go check that out. All right, guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you tomorrow.